Want to know what's in the March 2022 keto crate? We'll find out right after this. Hey guys, welcome to the March 2022 Keto Crate unboxing. Use the link in the description box below to get a discount on your very first Keto Crate or stick around to the end to see how you could win a free March 2022 Keto Crate. Okay guys, jumping right into it. Mmm. When women take care of their health, they become their best friend. Hello. International Women's Month, I am here for it. Yes, Maya Angelou, I do in fact wanna be my own best friend. I, I want to say when women take care of themselves, they take care of the world. The world changes, you know what I'm talking about? Yes, absolutely. In celebration of Women's History Month, I am here for it. I am here for celebrating all things ladylike. Oh my gosh, just so much literature but I don't wanna peek inside to see if it lets me know what's in here. Let's go. First item. Oh, okay. Another HelloFresh. I mean, they are killing it with this HelloFresh literature. Or is this, oh, this is Green Chef. Is it Green? Lord Jesus. Comment down below. Does anyone use these meal delivery services? How are they? If they can afford to give you, here's my thought. If they can afford to give you $120 off, how much does it cost? <laughs> like, Oh my gosh, but let me know. Like there is Green Chef, HelloFresh, there is Factor, like all of these meal delivery. Does anyone use those? Comment down below and let me know what you think about them, how the food tastes, and is it worth the money? Please, I have to know. Jumping into the snacks. Nope, more literature. Oh, ooh, Love Good Fats. Hopefully that means there's a Love Good Fats bar in here. Save a dollar on your flavor of choice. And it's flavor with a U because yes, we are Canadian at Love Good Fats and I love that. Can I find some snacks? First, oh, <laughs> speaking of snacks, we got fat snacks. I am here for it. Once again, I feel like the packaging is off center like because the double starts around back here like double chocolate but that's not gonna stop how good it tastes i'll tell you that uh fat snacks fat yeah double chocolate cookies two cookies all right and so serving size is one cookie so there are two servings per container 90 calories per one cookie eight grams of fat five total carbs that's great one fiber two sugar alcohol yeah, so that's two net carbs per cookie. That's amazing. Two grams of protein. They feel like, okay, the package is this big, but the cookie is like this big and they feel kind of stuck together. But hopefully, regardless, it's gonna taste delicious. It's chocolate, it's gonna be great. Next, I was like, it feels like another cookie. Cakewalk birthday cake. Okay, now this is very different because Usually the Cakewalk birthday cake has the sprinkles on at least the packaging. I'm very interested to see if the cookie in fact has sprinkles, um, but I really love the cookie department. I love their flavors and I'm, I've had birthday cake before, but it's had sprinkles on it. So I wanna see if anything's changed. Serving size, one cookie, calories, 250, 22 grams of fat, 22 total carbs, six fiber, 11 sugar alcohol, uh, five grams of protein. So yeah, how many net carbs is that? Five net carbs? I mean, yeah, for a cookie this big, yeah, it's gonna be worth it. But I'm, I'm just so interested to see, there's no sprinkles. I wanna, I wanna know what up with that. I can't wait to see this on Smash the Crate. Okay, real fat foods for people over profit. Almond flour crackers, okay. Here we have our, we have our first, uh, never heard of this before, and this is real fat foods. This is all the indulgence, none of the guilt. Okay, so gluten-free, dairy-free, keto-friendly. Serving size, one container. There are 150 calories, 12 grams of fat, six total carbs, five fiber. Uh, so that's one net carb for this whole thing, uh, and then five grams of protein. The ingredients are almond flour, egg white, soluble tapioca fiber, salt, garlic, onion, xanthan gum. I mean, that's not too bad. That's what you'd expect out of some crackers, but I've never heard of 
real fat foods before, and that's fat with a pH, you guys. If, if I didn't, if I didn't emphasize that, that's fat with a pH. That's a different, that's a totally different type of fat. If you know what I'm talking about, comment down below. What does PHAT stand for? Next. Oh, we have a fat bar. I haven't had one of these in so long. Raspberry and almond. I think these are the British people, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, it says two net carbs, high fiber, prebiotic, no palm oil, zero added sweeteners. I am here for it. Serving size, one bar, 134 calories, 10 grams of fat, 13 total carbs, 11 of those are fiber. Wow. Uh, three and a half grams of protein. The first ingredient is almonds and the next ingredient is chicory extract. So yeah, that's, that's a lot of fiber right there. Yes, produced for Fat Bar Limited, um, Edinburgh, UK. I knew, I, lo I love these. They're chewy and delicious, but this packaging is new. Maybe because it's a new flavor, raspberry and almond. We'll see. Oh, next. <laughs> Oh, I was not expecting this. Next, we have Choc Zero, dark chocolate with sea salt, coconut. Oh, oh my gosh. Can you say mounds, anyone? Oh, this is gonna be great. I mean, I don't know what sort of deal Choc Zero and the Keto Crate have like established, but I am here for it. We've gotten like Choc Zero in every Keto Crate, what, for the past four ones? I'm obsessed. Keep it coming, Chalk Zero. Oh my gosh, their keto bark is absolutely delicious. This is dark chocolate, uh, sea salt with coconut. I mean, this is going to be so great. So there are six little bark bars per container, 120 calories, nine grams of fat, 16 total carbs, 13 fiber. Uh, so what is that? Three net carbs per bark piece. And I am here for it. Next, we have, aha, love good fats. Oh no, oh, that's sad. This was the lemon mousse flavor, but it's open, you guys. I can't do that. I can't do an open, uh, an open love good fats bar. I'm gonna have to reach out to my friends at the Keto Crates and let them know. Um, I mean, but granted, this is lemon mousse. Would I have really enjoyed it anyway? We don't know, but we'll never find out. Now, because it's already open, I can't smell any lemony. I mean, Lord knows how long this has been open. So like, I'm sure all the flavor is dissipated. Like, but if you get a closed one, then you will be able to enjoy one bar for 190 calories, 13 grams of fat, 14 total carbs and nine fiber. Uh, and so what is that? Five net carbs and then nine grams of protein. Oh, I'm sure my husband will be upset about that. But like you guys, it, it, it arrived open, so I can't, I can't do anything with this. Okay, next. Oh man, better than good foods, veggie infused protein puffs, cinnamon roll. Now when I tell y'all, these are gonna taste exactly like a cinnamon roll because better than good foods is known, at least by me and in my family, as having like one of the most accurate description to flavor like companies in, in the keto game, right? Like when they tell you it's gonna taste like an entire hamburger, it's gonna taste like an entire hamburger, right? And so I am not surprised or I'm not worried at all. When they put cinnamon roll, it's about to taste like a cinnamon roll. So one serving size is one package. And then once again, what the, I can't see all the nutritional information cause it's like been sealed at the back here, but one package is 170 calories, 10 grams of fat, 16 total carbs, 12 fiber, and four sugar alcohol. So that, that's, that adds up to zero. I don't know. Uh, and then 10 grams of protein. Yeah, it says zero net carbs here. So, wow, that's crazy. So if you're counting total carbs, 16, but apparently net carbs are zero. I bet these are gonna taste delicious. All right, oh. Next, we have sea salt and cracked black pepper, uh, Southern recipe, small batch pork rinds. I love them. If it's not, if it is not like hot and spicy, my next favorite flavor is sea salt and black pepper. So these are going to be delicious. Uh, serving size, one package, 130 calories, eight grams of fat, one total carb and 14 grams of protein. Yeah. I mean, you can't go wrong with Southern recipe, small batch. Oh my gosh. 
How dare they? I have not seen a meat stick in what, three months? And here you, here you gonna go, Keto Crate, giving me a meat stick. Maple and pepper, okay, uh, from Big Fork. Uh, it is a craft pork stick made in the USA, small batch. I, I expect to be tasting some maple and I expect to be tasting some pepper. Serving size, one package, 60 calories, two and a half grams of fat, two total carbs, has to do with that maple, I'm sure, uh, and then seven grams of protein. Yeah, so the ingredients, pork, water, cane sugar, maple syrup, right? And then like sea salt and pepper, like all these things. Definitely sugars, but you know, when you're only getting this much, like to each their own macros. So if this ain't sweet, I won't enjoy the meat. But okay, I mean, I, there had to be a meat stick sometime, I guess. So welcome back, meat sticks. Welcome back. Oh, Keto Crisp. I know my husband's gonna love this. Keto Crisp. And it's just the original almond butter. Like, you know what? I already know that on Smash the Crate, I'm just gonna taste this and I'm just gonna give the rest to my husband because he loves these things. These are one of his favorite keto snacks as a non-keto person or keto-ish as he would tell you. Uh, okay, so Keto Crisp by Taste Can Do. These are my favorite people. Uh, serving size, one bar. There are 220 calories, 17 grams of fat, 18 total carbs, 10 fiber, four sugar alcohol. So that's four net carbs uh, and then 10 grams of protein. These are delicious. I love Keto Crisp. I love the folks at Can Do. I love this company. I love all their flavors. I'm pretty sure I have a discount code. I will put the link in the description of this video. These are worth it. I already know that I love these. And then finally, I was, you guys, my, some of my stuff had some residue on it. And I was like, oh, this is dusty. What is that? It's the lemon, it's the lemon residue from the Love Good Fats bar that I can't eat. So I'm just like, why is this, why is this dusty? But we have Good Sam dark chocolate candy coated peanuts. Oh, that's going to be good. And look, it's actually like, like blue. They kind of look like Robin's eggs, Jordan almonds, if you will. Um, I'm excited to try these. I've had these before. I love the crunch of the, the outside coating. Uh, and so I'll be excited to try that again. They do use isomultulose, which is some sort of sweetener, but, and I think that's what allows them like the, the really candy coated sort of situation, but serving size, there are three and a half servings per container. Uh, and then for each serving, there is 110 calories, eight grams of fat, 12 total carbs, two fiber and seven sugar alcohol. So that's five net carbs per serving and then four grams of protein. So yeah, okay, so apparently there are three net carbs per serving because they're subtracting 60% of the isomalt. They are doing some legit math right here. So if you get this, be sure to look at the back to see how they're calculating the net carbs. Okay. Overall, we are done with the Keto Crate. There are some good things in here. I mean, only just a couple of things that were like really excite worthy. I mean, always chalk zero. Uh, but you know, there are some things that I know that I like, some things that I'm excited, like from companies I've never heard of, like I'm excited to try. Smash the Crate will be fun, but it'll it'll be like a review because I've, I've tried most of this stuff before. But that's once again, what I love about the Keto Crate is like, it just delivers you things that you know you love already, right? You don't have to go to the website. Plus you can't get this stuff in single uh, servings, right? You can't just buy one of these. You have to buy a box of 12. And I'm just like, what if I just want a sampling, a variety of everything, right? That's why I love the Keto Crate. And if you want a discount on your very first Keto Crate, click the link in the description box below. Or if you're like, I'd rather have one for freebies. You know what I'm talking about? Then comment down below on this video, which of these items do you like? Have you ever tried? Would you be most excited to try out of this Keto Crate? And we'll draw the winner on the Smash the Crate series uh, where myself, my husband, and my mother try all of these items, right? Because we don't just talk about it. We bees about it. We eats about it. You know what I'm talking about? So comment down below. Let me know which of these items you're most excited for. And then join us over on Smash the Crate to see if you won. Thank you for joining me, guys. I'm excited to try this stuff. If you've had the Love Good Fats lemon situation, like, let me know what you think lemon mousse because we're not going to be able to try it and i know 
I'm upset. I'm gonna, I'm gonna reach out to the keto crate. And here's the thing. I know they're gonna send me another one. I know they're gonna say, oh my God, we can't believe it. So sorry. Customer service on a trillion with the keto crate, okay? If you ever have any issues, just email them. Just a little bitty boop, you know, Instagram them, do something, and they will always, always resolve your issue. So have a good day, everyone. See you over on Smash the Crate. Bye. Want to know what's in the March 20... Uh.